Hey Gemini, this is going to be an X reading to see if your ex is likely to return when you guys get back together. This is for Gemini, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, and Jupiter signs. Let's see what's going on for Gemini and their ex to see if the ex is coming back. If you want, you can go ahead and insert um, the person that you're thinking about their name while I say, um, will they come back? Is it likely that they will come back? Let's see. Is it likely that Gemini's ex will come back? Please show me. Please show me. Gemini's ex will come back. Please show me Gemini and your ex. Show me your guy. Gemini and your ex. Is Union likely? see guys what we got going on here this is you currently this is your ex okay they're trying to get themselves together and you're still feeling a little um, salty uh, neglected abandoned here currently this is this is what's going on currently with you guys um, I feel like your person is trying to get themselves together they're trying to find a good balance um figure out what's right in this situation what they need to do you know for themselves so that's what's going on currently let's see what you guys want yeah you want to be very stable and abundant within yourself you want to be able to take care of your family um you want you really want to work with somebody, work with this person, I see, because you're facing them. Um, what they want is basically to stay in the, in the mind frame that they were in, is what it seems. Because they have a sense of pinnacles here, which is working together. They're trying to find a way, figure out like what, what it's going to take to, to make this work, I feel. But they're not facing you is the issue right now. So it's almost like they are trying to, like they want it to work, but they're not really looking at themselves to see what is really the issue i feel like i feel like they're this person's selfish and they've probably been been that way for a long time i feel like now and it's possible that you know, they are sharing with someone else as possible. Um, but I really just feel like they are not very forthcoming with emotions. I feel like they only give when they can receive something like and not like an equal, you know, exchange of, you know, emotions, ideas or whatever. But it's like when uh, somebody, when somebody is, say, for instance, they want to date someone and they don't feel like they're really this person's type or whatever. They may throw their money around, you know, to try to, you know, lure people in. And I feel like this is kind of that person's um, stance here. Yeah. So they are really, really needing to, you know, balance out their emotions, their um, energy in general. Okay. Hmm. This is what you need. Judgment. I feel like you need to make a decision 
to do what you need to do for you outside of this connection here. It's what I feel. Because once you do that, if this person is meant for you, there is no way and nobody that will be able to prevent it, okay? So I feel like you need to decide to just take care of you. And it seems like that's what exactly what you want to do here with the Queen of Pentacles, okay? A lot of Earth here. We have Scorpio. We have Sagittarius, Virgo, Taurus here, all right? Then the High Priestess fell out, as I said. That's what they need, the High Priestess, to be forthcoming, to use their intuition, to not be secretive, to share. They need to share their emotions, you know, and not be, make you feel um, like there's something missing. And I feel like that's the way you feel. Like, like with this person, there's always like a question mark or something here, okay? Let's see if union is likely. One card, guys. For if union is likely. Most definitely. Most definitely. Because a magician, they know and they have the tools. They know what tools they need. And they also have those tools to make it happen. So it's definitely possible, for sure. Definitely possible. But I feel like, it's funny because this is Gemini Virgo right here, um, the, the magician. So there's things, I feel like there's things that both of you contribute in the relationship. And I feel like you guys need to like meet on a common ground and you know, really, really sit down and discuss what it is that, that needs to happen here. But this is definitely um, likely. But I feel like the ball is in the other person's court here, okay? I'm gonna pull an angel answers card with it. I'm gonna pull a divine feminine card, okay? I feel like this is too, it is. First, we have the cosmic egg, the divine feminine. I hold the universe within me. I am the force of an ever expanding love. Okay. All right. Then we have Lilith, the first woman. I am the voice of my body and soul. I choose the life that I desire to live. So nobody has control over you and nobody nobody can define your happiness, okay? Nobody can make you happy. You have to make yourself happy. You have to find happiness within yourself, love yourself before, you know, you can incorporate someone else in your life. So Again, with the judgment card, you, you have to make the decision to love yourself first, to do what's best for you first and foremost, okay? All right, so let's see what's, what we got coming from Angel Prayers. Angel Prayers card. These cards got all discombobulated there. All right, guys, we'll take that one. We have Synchronicity. Thank you, angels. I trust your well-timed guidance and signs. I feel like you've been seeing signs here. So pay attention to, you know, the things that are going on around you. You see 111, um, 555, 444. Those are, those, those are synchronicities, especially if you see these numbers like repeatedly over and over again, or, you know, just things that stand out to you. Okay, so pay attention to the signs because you're being prompted to do something 
or you being um, what you're doing is being confirmed in some way. So that's what I have for you guys for November 13th through the 20th as far as your ex if they're coming back and I feel like it's definitely possible but I feel like it's in the other person's hands here for sure. They need to make it happen and they can make it happen. Okay? Talk with you soon.